Hey guys, this is Tonner, and today I've heard a new rumor about next patch. Now, I know that we haven't really had many rumors about upcoming patches and stuff. Usually, stuff's being heard about further in advance, like it's going to be coming soon-ish kind of thing, but this one I'm hearing is going to be next patch. Now, whether this is confirmed or not, I'm not sure. This is a completely new source, but I mean, every good source starts as a new source at some time, so we can kind of hope, because this is something that people have been asking for for a while, and we have heard a solution is in the works from it. Uh, Boundless actually confirmed in their interview with us uh, that a skill raid team is coming or a skill solution. They said, we basically said, look, uh, skill and mystic have kind of fallen behind and they said we've got plans for them. So this is from what I'm hearing is the plans that a secret Avenger rework will be happening next patch with, uh, I think, think there's one new character it's either one new character or two new characters uh either one character and a rework or two new characters uh, they kind of it was a little bit cryptic so uh, we'll see so these are obviously the three members of the team at the moment. We've got Maria Hill being able to summon and heal up. Cap America Sam, a tank for days. One of the best tanks in the game. Uh, and being able to kind of protect his guys and get that speed up as well. As then finally Sharon Carter with the control. Now one thing that they did say was Captain America's ultimate. Which was probably one of the most disappointing skills when it came out. When they announced it because it was actually, you know, technically it was bugged. But they said it wasn't bugged. This part here. From what I've heard, this is going fixed. Uh, it's going to be changed to, you know, hitting that amount of characters. Like, so if there's 10 characters out and you hit them all, then you'll get that much speed bar, uh, whether, you know, they are alive at the end of it or not. So there's going to be rework to Cap America, Sam, and rework to Maria and to Sharon. Just some touch-ups, obviously. They don't need a huge rework. They just need kind of a little bit here and there. Um, and from what I've heard as well, Sharon is going to get a new costume. Obviously, the Sharon that we've got here is the one from the Falcon and Winter show, but uh, Falcon and Winter Soldier show. But within the comics, she's more... Um, She's not, like, she doesn't necessarily, like, look like with the hoodie and the green jacket and stuff like that. Um, this is more, obviously, a Falcon Winter Soldier slash, uh, what was it? But, uh, Civil War costume? Um... That's more what she looked like there, but from what I've heard, it's going to be more of like in line with the comic book look with the, uh, the Agent 13 kind of look or a more modern day look. Who knows? We'll, we'll see exactly what kind of direction they end up taking that costume could work well. But the issue is that the one character that like the, at least the new character that I've heard for sure coming to the team uh, from these rumors is going to look very similar to her with the Mockingbird. Uh, obviously they have very different abilities. They have, well, I mean, they don't really, like, skill characters don't have different abilities. I think is a major issue here as well. Like skill, you can only take so far. Um, but they kind of work in different directions. Um, Mockingbird's more about like the, um, the nunchucky, are they nunchucks? I don't know. What do you call those? It's actually saying here. Weapons. Battle staves, they're called here. Um, obviously, she's more in line with that, kind of the battle staves and stuff. Um, she's, uh, they have very similar, this is interesting that she actually has a, a kind of super soldier formula in her. But I mean, then again, Black Widow does. If you don't know, Black Widow actually has a kind of super soldier serum within her. So does Fury. Both of them are skill within her there. So, um, Mockingbird being seal kind of works as well. Um, and the issue that I'll find here is that sh her hair and stuff, like her overall, her portrait looks very similar to Sharon's. So I'll be interested to see how exactly they kind of differentiate between them. Uh, maybe they go with more of like the Huntress look or something. Who knows? Like you can see Huntress up here. Um, who knows? I'll be very interested to see how exactly they in uh, they implement Mockingbird in here while also having Sharon there. Uh, maybe it's just because Sharon's... Um, got like the hoodie and stuff she'll look plenty different um now the other character that i did hear was hawkeye now they said hawkeye but they put hawkeye slash ronan so there's kind of two different directions they could be taking this one is the rework to hawkeye now we've had a significant change within the wave one team if we have a look at the wave one avengers um Black Widow got a new team with Skilletary, Cap America got a new team with uh, Rebirth, Hulk, Gamma, Bionic Avengers, Hero Asgard, 
Hawkeye is the only one here that's kind of, you know, homeless now. Now, they did also mention way back when they implemented uh, Kate Bishop into the game that for not too long do they usually kind of, like, it's not too long until he will have some kind of synergy alongside Kate or something along those lines. That was kind of the quote there. It was something about, you know, they don't usually ignore the Marvel lore. And obviously, we've got Hawkeye, we've got Kate Bishop as well. So, it makes sense that this could potentially be a rework here for Hawkeye. However, because of the fact that it said Hawkeye slash Ronan, there is a potential that we end up getting Ronan. If you don't know, Ronan was within um, Endgame um, as well. That's when he took on like the the Ronan suit and then was using the swords and stuff. Obviously, that's similar to kind of... Um, like he doesn't look too different. He's just, you know, Hawkeye. <laughs> um, but there was a significant difference in like the abilities that he could potentially have there as well. Um, the Ronin suit was also a big thing within the Hawkeye TV show too. Like obviously, um, with Kate and stuff, having the Hawkeye, uh, the, the, the Ronin suit and everything. Um, but this is a way that they could kind of differentiate it more from, um, more from the Hawkeye that we've already got. We also have a few different characters, or like a few different versions of existing characters now. So they're, they're kind of less afraid to be able to do that. You know, it's the same character, but it's very different. Like, you know how we've got... Um, uh, well, I mean, technically, Agent Venom is the same character as Venom, like the Venom symbiote and everything. Um, we've got, obviously, Captain America Sam and Falcon. Uh, we've got um, Spider-Man and symbiote Spider-Man. So there's some characters, Iron Man, Iron Man, Zombies, technically. Hulkbuster as well, making three different Tony Starks into the game. There's a fair few different characters now that we've got that are, you know, the same character, but different. I mean... I, I, you could potentially argue that Ben Riley is Spider-Man, but different too, if you want to c count clones. I mean, they're very, very different characters, and I, I guess not. No, that doesn't make, really can make sense, because then you have to count Madeline Pryor. Anyway, um, you can argue that, you know, there's room for Ronan to be able to be in the game now, which would be really cool. And I'd love to see Ronan within the game um, as his kind of own separate character rather than just being a costume. So, I don't know. We'll see whether it ends up being Ronan or ends up being, you know, Hawkeye just with like a Ronan costume or something. It would be really cool to see. So, yeah, that's the rumors for today, guys. Uh, Secret Avengers popping in with a rework next patch with uh, at least one new member, potentially two new members. Who knows? Let me know down in the comments what you guys think. Have a great day and goodbye.